There, so today we have another review, and this is a beer courtesy of Eric, so thank you so much. This is uh, Weiss Trash Berry, so German style tart wheat ale, 3.4%, so um, in the Ber uh, Berliner ABV range from uh, New England Brewing Company. And it's got interesting, yeah, I mean, Vi Weiss is white, so it's white trash. So they're playing on that with the trailer park and this guy and, and a three legged dog, and uh, wow, this is a little bit offensive. It's got this like, berry lady with her being pregnant so they're calling that white trash and but he's also wearing um uh, uh lederhosen so yeah it's this label okay anyway and then the label's a little bit weird because they're um, playing with both like I, I guess like how trailer park people or white trash people would talk but with german in it so it's like well god dang mindful in, in german uh, blah 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 and then it says uh, we tossed in an arsh ass in German, a load of uh, raspberries, blah, blah, blah. And then summer night with a three-legged hund dog, Prost, y'all. Uh, Prost, y'all. <laughs> now get out of here. Interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> That's all I'll say. Yeah, raspberries. Let's take it. Beautiful color. Wow, that's like neon pink. Don't remember the last time I saw a beer come in that color. Uh, raspberries usually for me come in this like deep, rich color. Um, this one looks like, uh, what is it? Uh, strawberry Kool-Aid? Is that a thing? Or strawberry drink? There's, there is, is a drink that comes in this cotton candy, pink, purple kind of color. You tell me what it is. Let's get it moment. Oh, that's a nice nose. Full on beautiful, rich raspberries. Um, despite the appearance, it really smells like there's a lot of raspberries in here. Oh, wow, it's beautiful. A little bit of wheat in there. A light, like, like just raw wheat. Some grains in there as well, just like the husky uh, grains that you're about to brew with. It smells awesome, cheers. Yeah, um, you certainly taste that on the palate. It really has this like unmalted grain or wheat flavor to it. Really tastes like you're just eating pure, uncooked um, wheat. Yeah, drive through. I really like that fact that that's there. Berry flavor is actually relatively restrained. It almost tastes like this was second use berries or something, raspberries or something where, yeah, where you got the flavor out of it. So it's not jammy anymore, but it's still reminiscent of the fruit and the fruit's just floating around in there. It's not like, uh, intense like acidity or jamminess or seed flavor. It's just like the skins that have sort of just been already um, used up and then now you're just like, you know, using the rest of the flavor that's available in that berry. Acidity on this is actually only medium to medium minus. Not that tart at all. But this, it makes it drinkable. And the fact that you have malt in there makes this just a beautiful, slightly tart wheat ale at 3.4%. So it's a very drinkable beer with also the fruit not dominating too much. So yeah, with that Goza, the Here Goes It Goza from uh, Distill being so intense, this one's a nice one where it's just a nice sipper, nice crusher, not sipper. As I drink it more, the acidity tends to build. So this is actually more towards medium acidity uh, up front, but then it rides away. So it transitions on you, which is quite nice. And it makes the beer drinkable, but still exciting at times develops on the palate. You find the berry here on this sip. You find a little bit of the malt on this sip. You find a little bit more acidity on this one. Um, this is really good. This is nice. This is a well-constructed beer. Uh, very much like a pure crusher. Yeah, the beautiful color as well. Wow. Has it gotten darker as I poured it? That's possible. Huh. Might, maybe there's like, you know, uh, more concentrated uh, berry content on the bottom it's gotten this beer a little bit more hazy a little bit more glowing but man look at that intensity of color i like this color it's a fun color it doesn't just doesn't look like beer and it's a good one yeah it's nice 91 89 actually i like i like the drinkability of this one let's go with the 90 on this one this is very good this is vice trash from new england brewing company raspberry edition until next time guys cheers later